All right, folks, this is Spaz88. Some sent away laundry detergent here, odorless. I'm going to be using a cap full of it. I actually have a little uh, measuring cup here, some medication measuring cup. Fill it up. I start with my uh, socks, underwear, t shirt, just a light brown t shirt, and a pair of shorts. Because uh, Maryland's archery season starts uh, September 11th this season, so it'll be extremely warm. Might be a little decent in the morning, but then I don't get, uh, get in the 70s or 80s in the afternoon. Uh, more socks. Uh, a light camo t-shirt, probably for the morning, the afternoon. It'll be just straight up uh, pair of shorts, t-shirt, and leafy wear. And a real light face mask. These are the gloves I'm going to be using this year. Until we get the extreme cold. And always wash a pair of heavier pair of pants just in case in September we get some uh, cooler mornings. There isn't much to this. It's just doing it. And I actually repeat. This is my bow rope. I actually wash it too. Uh, I repeat this as much as possible in September and October because you're always sweating and I'm typically dragging a few deer out in this process so uh, actually some of my clothes actually do carry a lot of uh, human odor on them. Uh, you want to be as fanatical as you possibly can about that and I even wash my backpack. Uh, I probably won't show me do uh, show you guys doing my laundry uh, in October and November, but I have heavier clothes to use then. I start my washing machine up on large, regular. Take a cap full of magic, pour it around, rinse the cap out. And what I'll do is I'll let it run its complete cycle. Uh, pull the everything out of the washing machine, then hang it up on hangers and hang it outside. And this is usually a two, three day process for me. So it looks like uh, Redneck Village around here for a while. I actually wash my uh, items, hang them out, I bring them in in dark, then I rehang them out before I go to work, hoping that it doesn't rain while I'm gone. But if it does, I just rewash the clothes anyhow. Uh, I use uh, Sentaway products most of the time in Scent Killer. Uh, I actually had a lot of success in the past, but whatever you can afford in these lines is what you want to do. You want to try to uh, eliminate as much human odor as possible. And another one, another key point to me is wind. Uh, I hunt a lot of public ground, even on my private ground. The wind ain't right, I don't hunt it. I don't care what kind of caliber of a buck's in there. You always try to hunt the right winds, uh, clear up till they're uh, heavily, heavily rotting. Then sometimes you can get away with a little more uh, with your wind. But typically you won't. But uh, this is a time to hunt video. And I'm doing for a Drury's contest. Uh, as I explained before, time to hunt for me is as uh, soon as the last season's end, which was January 31st in Maryland. Uh, the following day, I was shooting my bow and I actually scouted a spot here in Pennsylvania on that Sunday. Uh, thank you for watching Spaz 88.